real though. We are though. Rambo. That's silly, dog. Incredible. If you want to see how it tastes, a jerk iguana, iguana, come to our channel. Come check us out. Come check it out. Beautiful. Look at that right there, y'all. We're getting a little fish pedicure. Oh, y'all, since the salon is closed, we're out here getting a little fish pedicure. We got little guppies. We got, there's some ghost shrimp in there. Oh my gosh. Look at this creepy crawly right here. Whoa. Whoa. So fast, y'all. We just found a centipede. Wow. Look at it. Oh my gosh. Eating these lovely, nice blue mangoes. Dude, they're eating good, bro. Eating like, do y'all see these, bro? I would love to have a mango like this, bro. Like, I don't. Like sweet mango, bro. They have oceanfront property, fresh mangoes, and fresh vegetation to just chill on all day. Salt in the bag, baby. We know we don't gotta add no salt. It's already gonna be seasoned. Chill, nice colors. She's like a camouflage for the wildness. She got a couple of cheetah prints on her. Look what those rascals are doing. Those sneaky. I think that the one that's walking, I think he's the alpha. And he's trying to assert his dominance on the, the lesser alpha. But they keep bobbing their heads at each other. What happens, hold on. Yeah, that, that big, oh my gosh. Flip him up in the air, all right? We don't know how fights are. One, two, three. three. There he is. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh no, oh. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my gosh. Trying to show that other iguana a fat lesson, but we taught him a fat yeah, lesson. Right. Oh, it's a baby lizard. Wow, look how tiny. Tiny and fat. Dude, that's probably the smallest lizard I've ever seen. Guys, check this baby out. Wow, look at that. He probably just hatched today, guys. There you guys have it right there. First interaction, guys. Newborn baby brown lizard with an iguana. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Nope. Oh. Oh my gosh. And he actually have a mango in his mouth. Dude, you think we should teach that thing a fat lesson? Bro, you got the snare? All right, right there. Don't spook, don't spook, don't spook. Guys, you guys are seeing the proof right there. We found the culprit. He has been munching on mango, all right? Oh, whoa, 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 he's charged up, y'all. Oh, come here. Get that mangoes. You think that's so cool, bro? You're taking the gourmet's mangoes? He's right there. He's right there. So right now, we're going to check it. Let's go, guys. Bro, oh, we actually caught something. Yo, you see that guy? That's a guys. Guys, if there's one tagu, there's more tagu. Let's have a little bit of this. Oh, look. I got right here. So look, guys. Oh, wow. Guys, we just hooked onto a really nice fish. Oh, my gosh. He's so strong. Oh. Oh, oh. oh. what the? He threw it. He spit the hook. Oh no. Guys, that's what happens when you fish for big fish with tiny hooks. Uh, boys, we just caught two monster snakeheads. Look at the size. Bro, that is a straight beast. Try to go the opposite way where his head is facing. Yeah. There you got it, so pull, yep. There you go, there you go. Check it out. Yeah. So we, we just caught this iguana. I just want to show you guys that.
Ended this iguana right here and just wanted to show you guys the tail of it. It's due to the fact that something can grab a tail, something can grab your tail. You can lose 90% of it as an iguana and then regrow it back. Man, we are out here doing some removal. <laughs> Check it out. We got a, got a little alpha right here. Apparently there's a couple of them on the property. No worries guys, the iguana man's here. We set some traps. We got the pellet rifle, we got the catch pole. So we did set some traps as well. As you guys can see, one is closed right here. Wonder. Oh yeah, we got one. I think we found the other alpha. Oh my goodness. That's him? Dang. Guys, and we just, we just basically matched the hatch we knew that they were eating mangoes, so we decided just to put that in the trap. Oh, he's sticky. Come on out. Boy or girl? Ooh, look at this. <laughs> Dang! Yeah. This guy is covered! These things, they help some out of guess grip. But see, this is, where, this is why you wear long sleeves. I'm used to it already, but this is why you gotta wear long sleeves. It's just, over time, you like save yourself a beating. But hey, we got two alphas in the bag today. Two of them. What's that? We, we thought we were recording, but we weren't. But anyways, guys, that same iguana that we saw poking his head right there, we ended up flushing him out, out of that nest. As you guys can see, we, we're learning the behavior. This is all part of the removal job. You got to come here. You got to spend time. You got to see the iguanas and you got to learn their behavior here. Obviously, these iguanas like this tree, that tree as well. They peep down, make sure, see if this big mango tree is dropping any. Once they know that there's food on the ground, and there's no predators, guys. Oh. Guys, it's getting serious out here. Guys, this is guys, this is love right here. After the job, got some scones, got a sandwich, ice water, iced tea. Oh my goodness! Shout out to the clients taking care of me. You guys know I like to eat, and yep, this is right up my alley. Oh my God, those are homemade right there. Raspberry, vanilla scones. Oh if you wanna see how it tastes, a jerk iguana, iguana, come to our channel, come check us out. Come check it out.